If the Fitbit app doesn't have the latest stats from your Fitbit device, or if you stopped receiving notifications from your iPhone, your device might be disconnected. To sync your device, your Fitbit device should be charged and nearby. First, try to manually sync your Fitbit device. Open the Fitbit app on your phone. Below the Today tab, touch and hold the screen. Then pull down until you see the Sync Progress bar. Wait a few seconds to see if your device syncs. If not, swipe down from the top right corner to turn off Bluetooth. Wait at least three seconds, then turn Bluetooth back on. Try once more to manually sync your device. If your device still doesn't sync, restart your phone. Press and hold either volume button and the side button until the power off slider appears. To turn off your phone, drag the slider and wait 30 seconds. To turn your phone back on, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. If your device still doesn't sync, try restarting your Fitbit device. The restart process varies based on the device, but there's often a restart option in the settings menu. Check the Fitbit Help Center if you're unsure how to restart your device. If your Fitbit device still won't sync, the next step is to check whether your phone, the Fitbit app, or your Fitbit device have any pending updates. The Fitbit app is compatible with iOS 15 or higher. To check for system updates, open Settings. Tap General. Tap Software Update. Then follow any on-screen instructions. To update your Fitbit device, open the Fitbit app. At the top left, tap the device's icon. Then select your device. Tap Update. This option only appears if an update is available. Then, follow the on-screen instructions. To update your Fitbit app, open the App Store. At the top right, tap your profile icon. Tap Apps. Select the Fitbit app. If an update is available, tap Update. In order to sync your device with the Fitbit app, your phone also needs to have Bluetooth and internet access. To check that your phone is connected to Wi-Fi or cellular data and that Bluetooth is enabled, open Settings. If your phone has internet access and Bluetooth is turned on, you'll also need to make sure the Fitbit app has all the permissions necessary to sync. In the Settings app, tap Apps. Then tap Fitbit. Make sure Bluetooth, background app refresh, and cellular data are all turned on. Reopen the Fitbit app and, below the Today tab, swipe down to try to sync again. If your device still doesn't sync, you'll need to unpair and repair your device. On your phone, open the Settings app. Tap Bluetooth. Next to the name of your Fitbit device, tap the information icon. Tap Forget This Device. Tap Forget Device. If a message appears asking you to allow your device to display your iPhone notifications, tap Allow. Open the Fitbit app and wait. When a message appears asking you to allow your Fitbit device to pair with your phone, tap Pair. Try to sync your Fitbit device again. If you still have trouble, make sure your phone isn't trying to sync with a different Fitbit device. Open Settings. Tap Bluetooth. Select the device you want to remove. Tap Forget this device. Tap Forget device. Your Fitbit device can only sync with one phone or tablet at a time. If you have any other phones or tablets nearby that are signed into the same account, uninstall the Fitbit app on those devices. Next, check the Bluetooth settings to make sure your Fitbit device isn't paired to multiple devices. If it is, 
tap the Forget option to remove it on all other nearby devices. After completing all the previous steps, open the Fitbit app on your phone and try to sync your device again. If you're still unable to sync, contact Fitbit customer support.